Question number six. Have you ever had a threesome, and what are your opinions on them? No. Nope. Oh, I have it. Tell me. I'm, like she said, like, before, in a different radio video, she was like, oh, I'm like, I'm territorial. Like, I'm possessive. I'm very jealous. Like, I cannot even fathom the thought of my man touching another woman, mm -hmm. looking at another woman, and, like, let alone me and him getting off on that. Like, yeah. those things that will go in my head, like, the... Stuff yeah. I will be plotting after, like, like, like of course, every like couple is different. Yeah, you know, but for me, no, <laughs> no, um, yeah. If I'm hooking up with start. someone, yeah, and if they're down for it, I'm, you know, I would be down. Like, if we have no type of feelings and it's just for fun, mm -hmm. right? But if I like you, I have feelings for you, I love you, then I don't think I would. <laughs> no, for me. I, my thoughts, especially, well, I'm thinking in, like, being in a relationship mindset. What would be going in my mind is, are you enjoying her over me? Yeah. Like, you know, what are your thoughts? Who made as... you come? <laughs> yeah. Was it me or was it her? Because we're going to have a problem right now. <laughs> yeah. Do you like her titties more than mine? Her, right? her head more than mine? It's a whole But she has the bigger titties and you're here, like... Itty bitty titty come she better have no titties at all at that point. She better be ugly as fuck. Literally. I had um I had a couple who had actually asked me to be a part of their I remember when you told me that. And I said no because she was my close friend and she's like, No, like don't worry, like like he's my man and he wants to do it too and I'm like Oh, like, like, thank you for asking me, but <laughs> like, I'm honored. I'm honored. Yeah, yeah, I'm, oh, no, I'm dude. very honored. <laughs> yeah, thank you, I... both of y'all finding me attractive. But it's like, I, I told her straight up, I was like, you're one of my close friends. It's, it's, it's weird. Yeah, and it you never know? turns mm -hmm. out good. Yeah, like, you, you, you yeah. have feelings for each other, and like, I no. You see, I feel like you don't know what you would do unless you're in that situation. And a few years ago, I was at this little lingerie party for my friend at the time. And she had invited like a few other girls that I didn't know, but I was just like, whatever, it's just going to be all girls. This one girl that she was really cool with brought her boyfriend. And I was like, what is going on? And... Throughout it all, like, she kept, like, coming next to me, and, like, she was, like, being really touchy, and I'm, like, hmm, maybe she just had too much to drink, like, because, like, she wasn't, like, being all up in my face, but she was just, like, giving me, like, you know, like, when you're getting, like, a side eye, like, yeah. like, the dead like, yeah, mm -hmm. and, like, my friend at the time, she comes over to me, and she was just, like, yeah, um, so-and-so and so-and-so, -and -so, they're into stuff like that, but she's, the dominant one like she's the one that picks out the people she picks out the guys she picks out the girls because sometimes they would do like two guys and her or she would pick another girl and that I way I love that for her though yeah. Yeah. If, if the guys allowing another guy like I love that yeah. yeah no she she was dominant as fuck in that relationship like she called the shots like any girl that she wanted that's the girl that they hooked up with. Any guy that she wanted, that was the guy that they both hooked mm -hmm. up with. Like, like that's how they were. And my friend, she tells me she was just like, "Yeah, so and so has had her eye on you, and she was, and she's thinking about asking you to be a part of that." And I was just like, "The chosen one. <laughs> they chose you." Yeah. <laughs> like, little old me. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm not comfortable with this. I think it just also has to do with, like, because I'm very reserved in a sense where I don't like a lot of people being able to see my body, and I'm very, I'm not insecure, but it's like, I feel like I'm very sacred, and prized possession, like, yeah, yeah, like not, not everybody should be looking at it, and it's just like, I don't know you, I don't care for you. I know. And I'm if they're doing that with everybody else, imagine what kind of... Dirty. I'm we're both very sensitive so any mixture of juices and mm, no. yeah no just no hard no for me I don't ever think I I wish I could be 
mm-hmm. because I know it's a little bit more fun and it's like you know how you said earlier like check off the bucket list mm-hmm. but it's like it makes me feel really awkward because I'm just like what am I supposed to be doing mm-hmm. yeah <laughs> what's my role right, right now? exactly <laughs> Do she you took want the one me? I'm good at. What do I do right. now? <laughs> Must I throw it back or not? I've never... <laughs> yes, throw it back. <laughs> or if you get left out and they're more into each other than they are with you and you're just there like. No, did you, you ever see that video on Twitter where like that couple was having a threesome and he was just hitting the other girl and she was in her bonnet and she's just looking at them like, are he's enjoying, it? yeah, like there was a video on Twitter and she was just like. He's enjoying this a little too much. Uh, you see? And he was just by himself with her, like, and she was just in the room. She was naked, just yeah. in her bonnet. Can never be me. Yeah, no. never, the ever. Would actually plot death at that point. You would turn into a scorpion. Yeah. I will zap you with something. I don't know what it is. Like, wow. <laughs> Sammy, I can't. No puedo.